Welcome back, boys and girls. Welcome back to RCC Kids. We're so glad you're here. I'm Mr. Sauer. And I'm Miss Patrice. And we are glad to be here this morning with you. Yes. So what we're going to do, I'm going to have Miss Patrice open us up with a prayer. Let's bow our heads. Dear God, thank you for today. Thank you for letting us have Bible class, even if it's online, God. You uh, make a way for us to learn about you. And I pray that we learn all about you today and take what we learn and use it in our life. In Jesus' name I pray, amen. Amen. Thank you so much for that prayer, Ms. Patrice. All right, before we get started, we're going to go over the rules. The first rule is, the most important rule, is to bring your Bible. Your Bible. Your Bible. You Everybody got your, your Bible. Bible. If you don't have your Bible, pause the video, and go, get, go get your Bible, and come back. And we'll be waiting for you. We'll be waiting for you, because you're going to need your Bible. Yep. What's, our, what's our next rule? The second rule is sing and participate wow. as wow. if you're singing to the Lord because wow. you are. Did you guys hear that voice? <clears throat> yeah. All right. Yeah. She, no autograph. Miss Patrice got a great voice. <laughs> All right. Our third rule is pay attention. It's very important that we pay attention because there's something that God is trying to teach you guys today. Yes. And our last rule, again, our most important rule is ready? Have, Have fun. fun. All right. All right. So, before we go into our lesson, we're going to sing a song. And the song we're going to sing is, Whose Side Are You Living On? And I know you guys know that song, but if you don't, follow along, you'll catch on. All right, you ready? All right. Whose side are you living on? I'm, I'm living, living on, on the Lord's, Lord's side. side. Tell me whose side are you living on? I'm living on the Lord's side. I'm living on, 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 I'm living on the Lord's side. Well, I'm living on, I'm living on, I'm living on, I'm living on, I'm living on the Lord's side. Tell me whose side are you fighting on? I'm fighting on the Lord's side. Tell me whose side are you fighting on? I'm fighting on the Lord's side. Well, I'm fighting. I'm fighting, I'm fighting, I'm fighting, I'm fighting, I'm fighting on the Lord's side. I'm fighting, I'm fighting, I'm fighting, I'm fighting, I'm fighting on the Lord's side. Tell me whose side are you singing on? I'm singing on the Lord's side. Tell me whose side are you singing on? I'm singing on the Lord's side. I'm singing, I'm singing, I'm singing, I'm singing, I'm singing on the Lord's side. Well, I'm singing, I'm singing, I'm singing, I'm singing, I'm singing on the Lord's side. Tell me whose side are you living on? I'm living on the Lord's side. Tell me whose side are you living on? I'm living on the Lord's side. Well, I'm living, I'm living, I'm living, I'm living, I'm living on the Lord's side. Well, I'm living, I'm living, I'm living, I'm living, I'm living on the Lord's side. Great job, guys. I heard everybody. Everybody. I love to hear y'all sing. I heard Kamara. Okay, well, we're going to start our lesson. Of course, we're in the parables again. And the title of this lesson is Jesus Ask a Riddle, okay? Mm. And um, the theme in this lesson is that Jesus stomps the chief priests and elders with his riddles. So mm. we're going to talk about that. But before we start, turn your Bibles to Matthew 21. Uh, we were in Matthew 21 last week, didn't we? We were, we Lots were. Lots of parables we there. We were, we were. So Matthew 21, starting in verse 23 right, to 25. Right. Right, Everybody right. there? Matthew 21, okay. 23 through 25. I got and it. Mr. Sal is going to read. I got my Bible. I'm ready. All right. Verse 23, it says, Jesus entered the temple courts, and while he was teaching, the chief priests and the elders of the people came to him. By what authority are you doing these things, they asked. And who gave you this authority? Jesus replied, I will also ask you one question. If you answer me, I will tell you by what authority I'm doing these things. John the ba John's baptism, where did it come from? What is from heaven or of human origin? They discussed it among themselves and said, if we say from heaven, he will ask, then why, did, why didn't you believe him? Verse 26, it says, but if we say of human origin, we are afraid of the people, for they all hold John, they all hold that John was, the, was a prophet. Okay, so in this lesson, 
You may have missed the riddles, but we'll talk about it. Do you like riddles? Because I'm going to tell you some riddles. Me and my daughter, Sierra, we look up riddles and we tell them to each other all the time. See if the other one can guess what they are. Um, so it's one of our fun things we do. So I hope you guys like riddles this morning. I have a few. They aren't too difficult, but you may have to think a little. Um, and I will tell you this. I have the answer to each riddle right here in my bag. And it will be something that you've all even seen before. So I've given you some hints. Mm. So here's the first riddle. What holds water even though it's full of holes? Hmm. If you think you know it, raise your hand. Okay, we're gonna see. Hold on. I have the answer right here in my bag. It's a sponge. A sponge. <laughs> a sponge. That's a good one. Yeah. Hmm. See all the little holes on the ah. sponge? But they do hold water, don't they? They do. Okay. They do. That's good. I have That's another good. one. That's good. That's good. I have another one. All right. Next. Um, for you. What gets wet when it's drying? Surely you guys will get this ooh, one. Ooh. You will get this one. I think Raylani got it. What is it? You you know it, Raylani? Raylani? What about what Christian and, and the male probably yeah, yeah, definitely yeah. know it? Yep, yep. I bet you Nebea knows. Uh huh. Nebea too. Y'all ready? Yeah. It's a. Uh oh. A. Tom. 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 It gets wet it. when it's drying. You I get didn't it? Think about when that. your body's wet yeah, and it. it's drying you. I bet you under there. Wow. I didn't know. Okay. Right. So there you go. That's a good one. All right. All right, my last one. Okay, I have one more. Right. Now listen very closely. This one says, when I am filled, I can work or play. When I am empty, I do nothing all day. I bet you say Okay, do y'all know what it is? Park That's Park. a hard one, isn't Lyric it? Got it. Lyric got it. It's, it's hard. They, they might think, not know. I think Lyric got it. But, but what I will do, I will show you in my bag. What? It's... What? A glove. When I am filled, I can work or play, right? Because I'm filled with my hand. I know. But when I'm empty, I can't do anything all day. So, oh, uh -huh. I know good. you like that one. Make sure me. you go back to school you and tell me. your friends you got me. those riddles. Miss Patrice is pretty good at that. She huh? is pretty good. All right, so let's talk about our lesson. I think Jesus must have liked riddles mm -hmm. or two riddles too. Sometimes he used riddles to teach people lessons. One day, Jesus was teaching in a temple. The priests and elders of the temple didn't believe that Jesus was the Son of God. Can you believe that? Right. And they were upset because he was performing miracles. They right. did not want him. Who do you think you are? Right? Jesus said, I will ask you a question. Because they asked him, who gave you authority to do those miracles? And he said to them, First, I'm going to ask you a question. Mm -hmm. And if you can answer me, then I will answer you. See, because he's Jesus. He can right. do that. Thank You're you. not Jesus. Don't do that to your mom, your dad, Please. your sisters, Please your don't. brothers, your Please. teachers. Just answer the question. Just answer the question. Jesus can do that, okay? He says, here's my question. Did the baptism of John come from heaven or from men? Mm -hmm. Where did John get his authority? So he wants to know who told John. He could baptize, and did it come from heaven, or did it come from men? Mm -hmm. The priests couldn't answer Jesus' riddle. If they said it was from heaven, Jesus might ask them why they didn't believe John when he said that Jesus was the Son of God, because they're not believing he's the Son of God. Mm -hmm. So if, G if God told John to do something, and they believed that, and then John told them Jesus was the Son of God, then they would have to admit that Jesus was the Son of God. And if they said it was from men... The people would turn against them because they believed that John was a prophet. So mm. they were stuck in the yeah. middle. Do we get attacked or do we admit we're wrong? Mm. Hmm. The only way that they could answer is we don't know. Well, maybe the priests and elders didn't know who gave Jesus authority to perform miracles. But we do. Right. Don't you know who gave Jesus the authority to do miracles? Yep. It was God. God is his heavenly father, and God gave him the uh, authority to pour, perform miracles. And so we need to remember that God and Jesus have all authority over everything, and we need to trust and believe who he is. So right now, we'll close our eyes. Thank you for listening to this lesson. Thank you, guys. Thank close you. our eyes and pray. Let's pray. Dear Lord, we thank you for sending Jesus, your only son, and we thank you 
that you gave him the power and authority to do all things. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen. 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 Great lesson. Thank yep. you, Ms. Patrice. Do you want to go over the books of the Bible before we go? Yes, yeah, we go over the books of the Bible. Yeah, yeah, books of the Bible. Okay, y'all probably know them because I hear some of y'all been practicing them. Yeah. Raylani, I heard you've been practicing. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Lyric, have you been practicing? I'm mm -hmm. going to call you, Lyric. Yeah. All right, ready? I think everybody's been practicing. You want to do Old Testament? I'll do New Testament. I got New Testament. Okay, I'll do Old Testament then. Genesis, Exodus, Leviticus, Numbers, Deuteronomy, Joshua, Judges, Ruth, 1 Samuel, 2 Samuel, 1 Kings, 2 Kings, 1 Chronicles, 2 Chronicles, Ezra, Nehemiah, Esther, Joel, Psalm, Proverbs, Ecclesiastes, Song of Solomon, Isaiah, Jeremiah, Lamentations, Ezekiel, Daniel. Y'all with me? Yeah. All right. Me. Hosea, Joel, Amos, Obadiah, Jonah, Micah, Nahum, Habakkuk, Zephaniah, Haggai, Zechariah, and Malachi. All Good right. job. All right, guys. New Testament. Mark. Uh, sorry. They're Matthew. Like, you well. Testing you guys. Matthew, Mark, Luke, John, Acts, Romans, 1 Corinthians, 2 Corinthians, Galatians, Ephesians, Philippians, Colossians, 1 Thessalonians, 2 Thessalonians, 1 Timothy, 2 Timothy, Titus, Philemon, Hebrews, James, 1 Peter, 2 Peter, 1 John, 2 John, 3 John, Jude, and Revelation. Good job, Great guys. Good job, guys. Keep Good practicing job. those. Good job. We love you. We miss seeing you in person. And we will see you guys next week. Bye. See you.